That exciting win over the Packers last weekend has got Browns fans really pumped for another battle on the gridiron tonight. Here we go, Brownies, here we go, woo, woo. Fans got to the Muni lot bright and early this morning. Doug Breach of Madison, Ohio, arrived at his favorite spot at 715, something he's been doing for a long time. We get here as early as they'll let us in. Uh, we've been in this spot probably uh, late 80s. Really? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a great spot. It's right at the front of the line. And how does Doug keep getting this money spot? The only thing we have here is we have our, our flagpole cemented in the ground. And, and usually when people, if somebody comes up early, uh, they see us put our flagpole in the in the hole, in, a permanent hole in the ground, they usually yield. Doug's friend and Muni lot brother, Bill Kostonek, has even been given the title Mayor of Muni. I've, I've only missed two games out of 27 years. Illness. That's what I call dedication. No matter how hot or cold, oh, yeah. if you're healthy, you're down here. Yes, sir. True Browns fan. And for this bunch, it's fun just getting here by bus or, should I say, the dumb dog party bus. Well, basically a rolling Cleveland sports bar, I guess is a good way to describe it. It's got, uh, I mean, it's all old Browns memorabilia inside. It's got a setup for four kegs. It also has satellite TV and munchies and dog bowls, too. With all this hoopla, let's get the party started. At the Muni lot, Stephen Cummings, News Channel 5.